Welcome back to Squawk Box. Uh, Citigroup CEO Jane Frazier got a pay bump last year. Company lifting her pay by 6% to $26 million in 2023. That includes $1.5 million in salary and $24.5 million in stock-based and cash incentive awards. Frazier uh, has initiated an overhaul of Citigroup, including cutting 20,000 jobs in a bid to boost returns. I'm imagining some of those 20,000 people that are let go are looking at that payday thinking... Some of that should be theirs, right? It's, it's what happens. That's an. That's not. I'm just saying that's the 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 sort of psyche. That's yes. a, that's average. I don't know what we're paying Juan Soto. To, is it Juan? Yeah, I, I remember <laughs> the great Mario Soto. But I don't know what we're paying a good left-hander these days. It's a lot more than 26 million. I don't know what uh, Scar Joe's making yeah. in their next superhero movie, but it's probably more than 26 million. I'm glad she, I think she's doing Jane a good, Frazier in that, that category. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I th think she's doing something more important than those things, isn't she? She's got all those employees that, that are beholden to her and all the customers. and Right? It's a lot of responsibility. You, think if you screw up and you're working at United or Boeing. Coming up, a new report says that Russia could launch a space-based nuke as soon as this year. We're going to talk to a security expert straight ahead. And as we head to a break, a look at yesterday's S&P 500 winners and losers.